Hello, everybody. I'm in Montreal with Kristin Anderson, and I know that she doesn't need any presentation. She's our hero. She uh, was with us during the tough time that we had in Canada, and she had the courage to speak to our prime minister about uh, what he did to our Charter of Rights, what he did to us during the Freedom Convoy. She uh, stood up for what she believed in, and she did that, you know, I was so proud to listen to her in the European Parliament when Justin Trudeau was speaking about freedom there and knowing that, you know, we were not free here in Canada. So, Christine, welcome to our country. Thank you very much for everything that you're doing for that fight for our freedom. And actually, tell us a little bit more about your trip here. Well, first of all, I have to thank you for having me. And uh, it's just been phenomenal. I mean, what I experienced here, the reception I, I got, uh, it, it was just outstanding. I've never, never would have thought anything like that to happen, but it didn't, and I didn't expect it, not at all. But it was like, gosh, you're the Canadian people. They are so fantastic. They are so phenomenal. And uh, I really have to say, once I saw the Freedom Convoy taking off and doing all of that, I was like, yes, thank God, finally someone <laughs> is doing something. And that's what the world needed. That's what millions of people around the world needed. And I will be eternally grateful to the, the Freedom Truckers uh, because you guys did it all. I just resonated what you guys did. So that was uh, an inspiration for you and people in other countries when they, they were able to uh, solve that in the real convoy. But speaking about the convoy, I believe that now you are a real freedom convoy. Yes, you were part sir. of the convoy. Yes, Can you tell sir. me a little, a little bit more about that? I absolutely am. So they actually organized a freedom convoy for me. But so also to, to celebrate the one year of the Freedom Convoy and at the same time exactly. your presence here in exactly. Canada. But I got to sit in a truck, got to ride in a truck, <laughs> in a Freedom Convoy. And yes, it's official now. I am a Freedom Trucker and I'm a very proud one at that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, that's great. And I want to thank you for that because you put us also uh, on the, the international stage with your speech in Parliament uh, because uh, what you did, we tried to have that in the mainstream media, uh, our point of view, and it was very difficult, but your point of view resonated at that time in our mainstream media here. So I want to yeah. thank you very much and you're always welcome in Canada at any time. And uh, actually, I believe that our viewers are also very happy to see Christine with us today. And if you want to follow her or listen to her or speeches, where can they go on social media? On just, your just Google me. You'll find me all over the place. <laughs> <laughs> At this point, it's, it's just like that. Yeah, she's the queen of freedom. And I'm very pleased. So everybody, we want to thank Christine for everything that you did. Thank, thank you very you. much. And if you want to come back to our country, you're always welcome. I will. Whether and, you guys like it or not, <laughs> and, I will come back. And I must say that I like your pin about the PPC. Yes. So I may have a competition for the leadership <laughs> of the People's Party of Canada. Yes. You better watch out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's an honor, honorary a member of the People's Party of Canada. Oh, so I'm oh. very pleased. Congratulations. Thank you again. Oh, gosh. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. See you. Thank Stay you. strong and free.